Okay guys, it is 5.15, Tuesday evening. It's been calm all day and it was really, really hot. Ooh, that's a hot rain. Ooh, that's really warm. So, it's supposed to hit late tonight slash early in the morning for tomorrow. Um, we are in the red. We are one of the counties that they are suggesting to um, evacuate. But we're far enough away from the coast. I don't think we get <laughs> we got to worry about the storm surge. But we are going to get some wind and rain. I'll show you on the map right now where we're at. Okay, my little blue pointer here. This this is Crystal River, and we are just. It would be just right, right about the point of my pointer is where we are located. Right about there, maybe up a little bit more. So we're just, right about there is where we're at. So as you can see, Cedar Keys just right in the heart of it. And that would be 12 feet or more. Uh, Crystal River is looking like up to 12 feet uh, storm surge. So that's where we're at. Um, Cedar Key, we love to go to Cedar Key. I'm really worried about them. And Crystal River, where we camped out, did our overnight fishing trip there the other night. Um, getting bad. Um, sorry, the lens is fogging up. But, um, yeah, they're, they'll get hit pretty good, too. But all you hear about is Tampa. Tampa, they're worried about the storm surge, which could go like eight feet. But up around what we call the Big Bend and up around Cedar Key area and stuff like that, they could be looking at, you know, they could get a 15-foot um, surge. So, you know, I mean, that's... <laughs> you know that could devastate a little island like cedar key and it could devastate you know crystal river too but all you hear about is how how tampa might get seven feet but yeah this is this is what's going on right now so guys i'm going to run in i made soup beans today with a big old ham bone in it and with some man meat left on the bone so I'm going to go in and eat, and I'll keep you guys updated. I'll make another video here. Wow. I'll make another video here in a couple hours, or if things start really getting bad. So, I'll keep you guys posted. So stay tuned, guys. Thanks for watching. And thanks for all your comments, guys. But I, I think we're going to be okay where we're at. So, uh, we usually make it through all right. So, this evening, maybe here in a little bit, I'm going to move the vent up here. Move the truck over here. Kind of keep away from those trees there. So, all right, guys. Stay tuned for the next one. Whoa. Wow. Okay, stay tuned for the next one, guys. Starting to, yeah, we're starting to get the outer edges of it now. All right, guys. Wow. All right, I gotta move these cars. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm out for now. I'll post an update video here in a few hours. Oh, wow. Already. Okay, guys, we just lost power. Keeps flickering back on, but I hear right over in here somewhere, I hear a transformer banging and buzzing. So, all right. And it's about, uh, about 10 to 6 right now. About 550 so transformer went out over here somewhere hmm well shoot 
we are out. I just got supper done. So we got the cars moved. Put this one here. Put the vet over there. Just anything to get it. Get them away from that palm tree right there. Alright. Well. Hmm. I got to get some power into the house here. So I'm going to grab one of the batteries and my inverter. And um, try to get this <laughs> uploaded for you guys.